a normal inductive discharge, no shunting of the tesla circuit. Even trying to lay it on there, won't go through it. Even pressing on this gizmo just will not do it. Okay, shutting off the circuit, activating the shunt for the capacitive discharge. Now we're going through it, and you see the rock's broken off. So it definitely produces a shock wave. Interesting, no? So, there you can see the carnage of what it's doing. That'd be great to be able to get some close-up shots of that. Looks like it melted the rock right there. Those little bits and pieces would be, would be worth looking at underneath a microscope as well. Hot as hell. That thing is just hot. Thanks for watching. Ah. So you can see those little lebs. So as the discharge was going through the rock, melted it.
It'd be fascinating to have it assayed, but lots of other tests that need to be run too. That's where we may find some of those microscopic shockwave examples. Get some sort of microscope to look at that, that'd be awesome.